everybody, it's Jill at Redwater Dodge, home of the $10 oil change and rig ready rams. I have another 2019 diesel, so we're going to take a peek around. So under the hood, it's got the 6.7 Cummins engine, so you're going to be able to haul anything you need to haul with this truck. New body style, it's got the tow hooks, um, whole new front fascia, obviously. It's got cab lights, I love cab lights. Um, it's also got the tow mirrors, the new running boards, crew cap short box. Well, it's got the spray and box liner and it has bed lighting in this one as well. Um, if we go all the way to the back, it's going to have the backup camera, which more or less is standard in most trucks now, but just got to point it out. Um, but other than that, Jacob's going to show you guys the inside today and then I'll let you know how you can make yours. So I know they're starting to look pretty fancy on the outside and the inside to tell you the truth, but you still have the guts of a good old work truck. You've got the 6.7 liter Turbo Cummins powering this monster. You have your air, gear limiter right on this side, trailer brake right there, exhaust brake, tow haul mode, 4x4 right on the floor. Um, you've got, you know, this thing right there, no dial shift. I don't mind the dial shift myself, but I know some guys, some guys hate it. So you've got your column shifter right there power back window which is always nice to have it's also a defroster window which is pretty neat they made this a little bit bigger so you can toss your phone up there and you also have a little spot for a 12 volt charger up here you've got a sunglasses holder of course you have your standard you know you can swing that over but I always like to point out it does slide which is handy to have underrated but handy you have your six seat option right here so you flip that up six seat and if you look inside here you have a USB as well as a little uh, change holder for you. Slides in there nice and easy. If you look right here, you have a USB, let's call it a USB interface. So standard USB, I think it's called a micro USB, plus you have your auxiliary port right there. So you can hook up your phone right to the Uconnect. The Uconnect is pretty basic, but functional. So you've got the little touch screen there. You can hook up your phone, you've got a compass there, um, standard climate options down here, uh, traction control right there, cruise control, Bluetooth options. So if you are using it as a work truck, you can you know, enjoy hands-free calling and run your business right from your truck, which is very handy. You have uh, all your light options down here, so auto headlights, all that good stuff. Um, power windows, power locks, of course. And let's go check out the back seat. So as you can see, it's a crew cab, but there's tons of room back here. I mean, I'm not very big myself, but still lots of room. You enjoy lots of climate controls, not controls, sorry, but vents for your climate control right here. A nice little nook so you can put things in there. Cup holders back here. Of course, you do have the nice big floor mat which stretches the entire length of the back seat. If you flip the seat up, you enjoy a huge storage bin under your seat. As you can tell, it's got all the accessories like your, you know, uh, insert for your towing thing and your bib for well, the bra, I guess, for the front of your truck. So that's where they come from factory. And other than that, it's pretty standard back here. You've got your own window control. Of course, the power back window, which I already mentioned. And I'm not gonna lie, they're pretty comfy seats. I could, I could lay down, have a little nap, no problem. So if you want to pick up one of these trucks, give us a call 780-942-3629 or shoot us an email, sales at Redwater Dodge. See ya!